In this video, we are going to see a gingivoplasty. Gingivoplasty is a surgical procedure that is simple, but can provide dramatic results. Even if a patient's oral hygiene is good, the first step is to make sure we have a clean surgical environment. For this, we use the piezo scaler from Acteon and the aerosol assist, which removes intraoral fluids and provides aerosol reduction. Anesthesia is applied, giving pain-free anesthesia for the maxillary can be predictable by air drying the injection site, then applying benzocaine for 20 seconds. Deposit slowly, and then once 25% of the carpule is given, move on to central number eight, and then the canine number six. Bypassing the midline should be painless when injecting number nine since adequate time has passed. As you proceed to inject in order from nine to 11, each injection will not be felt as the previous injection site spreads to mask the injection on the new site. The Picasso diode laser with a 400 micron tip is activated and the selected gingiva is removed. Picasso diode lasers are affordable and are perfect for this procedure. The gingival architecture and zenith were analyzed before the procedure and are then listed by each tooth that will be altered with the measurements of reduction written next to them. Floss that has been cold sterilized can be used to measure a vertical line, but we opted to use the patient's lips. Although the practitioner is working alone, the aerosol assist automated and controlled the laser plume, intraoral fluid, and splatter. It was also used as a retraction device. Air, water, and the piezoscaler is used to remove ablated tissue and to verify the correct architecture is achieved. This is a very important step before finishing the procedure as ablated tissue might give the incorrect perception and therefore lead to less than optimal results. The after photo was taken a day later and the patient was happy to report no post-op sensitivity or discomfort.